हाय वेलकम टू द फोर्टीन लेक्चर ऑफ द चैप्टर आयोनिक इक्विलिब्रिया टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी द पॉइंट हाइड्रोलिस ऑफ साल्ट ऑफ स्ट्रांग एसिड एंड वीक बेस नाउ सी द साल्ट ऑफ स्ट्रांग एसिड एंड वीक बेस ऑन हाइड्रोलिस गिवज अस स्ट्रांग एसिड एंड वीक बेस नाउ सी इन दैट केस एसिड इज स्ट्रांग वाइल बेस इज वीक देअर फोर सोल्यूशन इज एसिडिक एंड वी नो दैट वेन एवर सोल्यूशन इज एसिडिक इट्स पी एच इज लेस दैन सेवन ना वाई सोल्यूशन इज एसिडिक बिकॉज इन दैट साल्ट एसिड इज स्ट्रांग वाइल बेस इज वीक फॉर एग्जाम्पल कॉपर सल्फेट फेरी क्लोराइड अमोनियम क्लोराइड एट्सेट्रा ऑल दीज आर दी साल्ट ऑफ स्ट्रांग एसिड एंड वीक बेस नाउ वी हैव टू डिराइव एन एक्सप्रेशन फॉर हाइड्रोलिस कॉन्स्टंट द हाइड्रोलिस कॉन्स्टंट इज डिनोटेड बाय के एच नाउ सी फॉर दिस वी हैव टू कंसिडर ए साल्ट ऑफ स्ट्रांग एसिड एंड वीक बेस से बी ए एंड दैट बी ए आयोनाइजेस कंप्लीटली and give ions see here ba on ionization gives us b plus and a minus now see a minus is the anion of strong acid and hence remains as such while b plus is ion of weak base hence reacts with water and give ions now see uh, this part is important in Uh, this expression what is important see when ba undergo ionization it forms b plus and a minus now that a minus is the anion of strong acid so this is important a minus is the anion of strong acid and hence remains as such while b plus is ion of weak base and it react with water see how it reacts see b plus reacts with water to form boh and h plus now we have to consider this reaction the hydrolysis is constant kh is given as it is equal to molar concentration of boh into molar concentration of h plus divided by molar concentration of b plus so we have written hydrolysis is constant for this reaction okay kh is equal to this part divided by this part and molar concentration of water is considered is equal to 1 this is our uh, equation 1 now we know that the ionic product of water kw is equal to molar concentration of h plus into molar concentration of oh minus so this is our equation number 2 now kb is equal to molar concentration of b plus into molar concentration of oh minus divided by molar concentration of boh okay so this is the equilibrium constant for the base this is the value of kb now this is equation 3 now from all these equations equation 1 2 and 3 we get kh is equal to kw divided by kb so this is our hydrolysis constant from equation number 1 2 and 3 we get kh is equal to kw divided by kb so in the previous lecture we have obtained the relation kh is equal to kw upon ka which was for the salts of weak acid and strong base and uh, how to solve all these three equations we have studied it in that previous lecture therefore i am not going to repeat here okay those who are new to this lecture please i suggest you to watch the previous lecture then you can understand how this value of kh is obtained from equation 1 2 and 3 okay now we have to derive an expression for degree of hydrolysis now remember that degree of hydrolysis it is denoted by h small h again we have to consider same reaction that is b plus reacts with water to form boh and h plus now see initial concentration if 
initially the concentration of b plus is c okay and initially there is no hydrolysis therefore the concentration of boh is zero and h plus is also zero now concentration after hydrolysis when hydrolysis take place the concentration of boh is ch that of h plus is ch then the concentration of b plus is c minus ch so we have to again minus that ch from that c therefore finally remains c minus ch now we know that kh is equal to molar concentration of boh into molar concentration of h plus divided by molar concentration of b plus now put the value of these concentrations so we get kh is equal to ch into ch divided by c into 1 minus h okay so one of the c from numerator and denominator get cancelled and finally we get h square c divided by 1 minus h again h is very small therefore 1 minus h is equal to 1 therefore kh become h square c or h square is equal to kh upon c or we can write h is equal to under root of kh upon c so when we take under root of this it will become h is equal to under root of kh upon c now again uh, we have derived in the last slide kh is equal to kw upon kb so we have to put this value of kh into this equation so we get h is equal to under root of kw upon kb into c so this is our expression for degree of hydrolysis of salt of uh, strong acid and weak base now we have to derive an expression for ph of salt of strong acid and weak base now see we know that molar concentration of ph plus is equal to ch see here that, that is uh, we have written the concentration at after hydrolysis the molar concentration of ph plus is ch here so that molar concentration of ph plus is equal to ch now c into just we have derived the degree of expression for the degree of hydrolysis and we have to put that equation for the uh, instead of h so c into under root of kw upon kb into c or we can write molar concentration of ph plus is equal to under root of kwc divided by kb so by solving this equation we get molar concentration of ph plus is equal to under root of kwc divided by kb now take negative log on both sides so minus log of ph plus is equal to minus log of under root of kwc divided by kb you know that minus log of h plus it is ph so uh, we have written ph here so ph is equal to minus log of so this square root can be written as in bracket kwc divided by kb raised to one half okay so it is equal to ph is equal to one half so this one half comes here in bracket minus log of kw plus log of kb there minus minus become plus so plus log of kb minus log of c so finally we can write ph is equal to one half into minus log of kw it is pkw so that plus log of kb it is minus pkb and minus log of c will remain as it is so here we have to remember that minus log of kw it is pkw while plus log of kb it is minus pkb so finally we have derived ph is equal to one half in bracket pkw minus pkb minus log of c so this is an expression for ph okay so in this lecture we have derived three expressions for the hydrolysis of salts of strong acid and weak base first expression was for hydrolysis constant that is kh is equal to kw upon kb then second expression for degree of hydrolysis it is h is equal to under root of kw divided by kb into c and finally we have derived an expression for ph it is equal to one half pkw minus pkb minus log of c so 
this is about the hydrolysis of salts of strong acid and weak base thank you